Hi guys, I wanted to do just a quick video about how stocks move both up and down, how they trend, because they don't just go straight up. They go up, they retrace, they go up, they retrace, they go down, they retrace, they go down, they retrace. And I know a lot of newer people have questions about what TTOs or triangle layouts as Rob calls them are. So hopefully this will help clear up some of that for you. And then we'll look at a couple chart examples just going to be a really quick bid here. So if we're in an uptrend, it's going to look something like this. Please excuse my drawing skills. Moves up, pulls back, moves up, pulls back. So each one of these is a TTO. In this case, these are just TTOs or triangle layouts back to trend. And if you were trading this chart, you could, those are places you could add to your position. Um, some TTOs are much larger and they'll actually stop you out. So for instance, if the stock did this and tanked through that line, that TTO would be big enough possibly to stop you out. So that's what trending up, looks like the opposite is true obviously if we're in a downtrend so a downtrend something like this and then each one of these guys is a TTO and again here's our downtrend so if you were trading something to the short side each one of these little guys, pullbacks to trend, could be places that you'd add. And then a triangle layout would look something like this, where it pops through trend and stops you off. So let's look at, real quickly, a couple charts from today with examples. So here's Tesla, and this is a fantastic example of an uptrend. And you've got little micro tries back to trend, just like we had in our drawing. So you could have added on each one of those. And then if you're looking, if you want to see what a larger triangle layout looks like, this big candle right here may be enough to stop people out. So that's an example to the upside. Let's take a look at SPY. And here is a good example to the downside. Let's draw like this, just to keep things simple. And you'll see you've got your trend. It pulls, bumps its head, goes back down, goes back down, goes back down. And then this actually may have been enough, depending on where your stop was, to actually get you out of the pipe. Position. So triangle layouts can be micro tries, which is what these little pullbacks on the one minute are. They're just pullbacks to trend, good opportunities to add. And then you'll have bigger tries that actually stop you out of trades. So I hope that is helpful for some of the newer people. Um, let me know, give me some feedback about what other concepts I can break down for you. And I hope this helps.